Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's Agnes and today I have a very exciting video because I'm going to surprise my husband with a new car. Now he's been driving his old car since our daughter was one year old, I believe. He bought a car from his friend who's had the car from brand new. So he's, uh, I believe, a second owner of a car and he's been driving that car for the last 11 years. The car is very run down and he always tells me that he worries that one day he will not be able to get to work. And now that he has to get to work every day for an hour, one way hour back, and although his car still stands and he's, it, you know, it still works, it's just not gonna last him very long. And I think it's about time that I think of him because he's one of those people that think about everyone else before he thinks about himself. He bought me a new car, you know, we got a new house two years ago, um, we renovated it, then he saved money to open a business. Everything is to better our future and to, you know, make us feel more comfortable. And himself, he drives old car that it's no longer comfortable and although it drives it's not very fuel efficient so you know he pays a lot of money for fuel this is why i thought i'll take a leap and buy him a new car now my husband is currently at work and he's left early morning of this hour and i just got off the phone with a dealer now these days because of the COVID, there is no longer a situation where you can go to the car dealer and test drive the car and then if you like it, you buy it. How it works nowadays, so you find a car online or you ring up the dealer, they will tell you what cars they have in stock, you pay a deposit, and then you either pick it up yourself with the paperwork ready for you before you make a payment, and they prepare the vehicle for you and you pick it up. Or there is another option, which I went for, is where at additional fee, they will actually deliver the car to you. So I'm going to wait now for him to come back from work and you know, he will see the car being parked up at the drive. You're probably going to be surprised what he sees and we will see what he says. I was considering to get like a big ribbon and stick it to the front of a car, but then that will give away for him that this car is a surprise and it's, it's a present because it will be like a present, right? This is really exciting for me because I've never done anything like that before and he really deserves to be treated because this man does everything for me and for kids and for our family. He's just such a lovely person and he truly deserves, you know, to be treated for once. So yeah, I'll film his reaction and show you what he said and everything. So fingers crossed he'll like it. Uh, but yeah, let's see what he says. So I've got the books and all the docs now and it comes with two keys. So what I'm gonna do, I found my old jewelry box. I'm going to put this inside the jewelry box so when my husband comes in, I'm gonna give him this. Now, let's have a look at the car. the car mm, smells lovely mm. a lovely little nippy car He must be home because I just heard the ring pinging. Yeah. He's home. <laughs> I wonder what he's gonna say. I'm gonna go prepare the keys. He's standing outside the house looking at the car. My phone just froze because Josh just called me to say to open the door because uh, there is a car parked out outside the house. Hello? Oh, did you ask them to move the car, please? Who? Oh. Whoever's car is this? Uh, I, can't, I can't squeeze from here, so would you ask them to move the car, please? I, I can't ask them to move the car because the car is yours. 
What are you filming? Why are you filming? I got the camera. Jake, it's uh, this car is yours. My car is mine. There you go. Pull in my leg. No, the car is for you. Cars for me. The car is for you. Open, open the. Where did you get the car? Open the present. Seriously? Yeah. When try you this. Try. Today. It's yours. <laughs> I'm not joking. The car is for you. It's someone's home. I reckon it's No, the car is for you. Someone's at home. You're winding me up. I'm not winding you up. <laughs> I, I know this is not an everyday thing, but I thought you try? you're trying to get yourself a car for so long. I and try. I took a leap and I bought it for I you. Try that. I hope you like I it. Try. Please don't tell me that you don't like it. It's nice. It's nice. I was looking for a car for a while. I took a Hold my back, please. Hold my back. I love your car, Daddy. Hold my back, please. Too. Yeah, okay, watch your homework back. Don't open it, okay? Because my work stuff in here, please. Come and have a look. It's nice. It's nice. It smells like new car. It is a new car. And it's yours. <laughs> Jay's sniffing. It's nice. Where did you get it? Today. Well, I, you know, it took me a few days to plan it all out, but I got it today. Um, I'm going to work, so. That's good, because my car needs a retiring anyway. <laughs> Good, nice, very nice. I'm very happy. Thank you. So I owe you one. Oh, we I've, even I've actually got one. We even, yeah. So I, I got you the BMW and you got me this side. Oh, nice. Thank you. I'm very happy. Do you want to take it for test drive? We yeah, need to go out and sort out the insurance you. because drive, we yeah. haven't got insurance on that car. So once we sort the insurance, then um, sure, you can take the test drive. Yeah, I happy. would go with you, but I've, there could nothing would just stay with the kids. Okay, so not break the car, please. Um, I'll let you take it for a drive yourself and then maybe you can just show people around yeah. how does it drive yeah thank okay. you right let's let's go and call the insurance people let's call the insurance <laughs> one second Put Jay in there. <laughs> That's your baggage. <laughs> right, we're gonna go and call the insurance people. Yeah. Um, yeah, we'll call the insurance people. And once the insurance is sorted, my husband will take you for a ride. My husband's sorting out the insurance now and I'm just setting up the camera for him so he can take you guys for a test drive because I'm just sitting here with Jay. Jay wanted really to go and sit up in the car just to kind of have a feel for it. So we haven't got car seats fitted in this car. So the main car where we drive the kids will be my car and this is just Josh's car so you can get back and forth to work. So yeah, well, he was happy. I'm so glad the plan worked out and I'm just so excited that I could have surprised him with this because honestly he deserves the world you like it yeah yes. let's go get daddy and tell him to take the car for a ride shall we yeah. come on let's go Right, let's 
go. Oop. Slowly, slowly does it. Need to get used to this car. It's nice and beautiful, very nice. Well, I needed an upgrade on the car, so I was uh, quite happy with the new surprise. I actually was looking at cars um, four or five months ago. I was thinking of upgrading my Golf. Uh, it's getting on a bit. It's still a good car, a reliable car, never let me down. Uh, I've got it for 11 years now, bought it for my friend. and. Um, because my work is quite far away and I was a bit worried that the car might break down and um, which would cause me a lot of issue on the way to work so I couldn't, can't afford the car to break down and I did mention it to my wife um, a few times that I'm looking for a car and I did say I'm going to buy a car this year uh, possibly in summer um, yeah nice Summer's coming, convertible would be nice, but yeah, this will do. The inside, interior, it is quite nice. It's it's not a BMW or Mercedes, uh, but it is, it's, a, it's a reliable car, very fuel efficient. This car, I believe, does average 69 miles per gallon. Right, this car here, um, bit of a review on this car well not a review I said just talk about it so it drives beautifully uh, very clean sort of like not too noisy engines very quiet uh, inside and um, drives very very smooth right okay it's 1.5 litre engine so don't expect to be going low to 60 you know in three seconds but it will get me to work and back in time so yeah great and um, yeah quite pleased actually didn't expect the to be driving a car like this to work so nice if you want a Nissan Qashqai uh, marry a Polish girl and uh, hopefully after 12 years you will get you a Nissan Qashqai Right, one more thing. Um, I want to say thank you to my beautiful wife. Thank you, Agnes. Thank you, darling. I really appreciate it. It means a lot to me. Uh, and I love you for this. Thanks. So Josh seemed to have liked the car. So the surprise worked out. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. And yeah, don't forget to comment below, like, subscribe, and we hope to see you soon. Bye.